Hey everyone, welcome back to Persona 5. What the hell are we going to be doing? <laughs> uh, I've lost it immediately. Alright, well, um, Futaba is ready to rank up. Um, I, I think she was ready to rank up. Uh, I don't 100% remember anymore, to be honest. Um, oh, let's go to the library, actually, and return that book. And actually, this is something I wanted to do. Not what I wanted. I wanted to do this a few episodes ago. Uh, where's Haru? Persona. Uh, she was a beautiful woman that appears in Duma's Three Musketeers, branded with the Fleur de Lis symbol. I think I read that horribly wrong. Uh, she used many aliases to control nobility and get her vengeance, so that's where she's from. I don't remember if I looked at that before, but I was definitely intending to after we started reading her, uh, her book. Uh, I don't want to borrow, I want to put it away. There you go. And we got nothing else here for, uh, for proficiency. Uh, I've got no books that can boost proficiency, I don't believe, but let's actually go check out... This is the bookstore? Yeah. Let's go check out this bookstore. Maybe. How can I help you? No. I think I might actually have to finish uh, this one before new ones come. So, uh... Well... What the hell can we do to up our proficiency? We can, we're going to go to Shinjuku, we're going to talk to uh, Chihaya, and we are going to get an affinity boost for uh, um, um, <laughs> well, Futaba is definitely ready. Uh, we hung up with her briefly and gave her a gift. We're going to get an affinity boost for, at this point, I guess, um, Hifumi. Uh, because I know she's not ready to rank up, do? so let's um, let's do that. Uh, where's he for me? Um, where? Oh, here! <laughs> wow, I'm right on her. I even didn't even realize it. All right, our feelings will reach them. Alright, there we go. What do you think? I, I skipped over that, but did that say I think her friendship level has increased or something like that? Like, this, I wonder... I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at that uh, in editing, um, if, and, uh, and see what that actually said. Mm -hmm. I guess you guys could just pause the video. What do we have here? This is, is, this is still probably uh, knowledge, isn't it? Yeah, knowledge. Alright, uh, let's actually quickly check out the... Where's the theater? Let's check out the theater here to see what we can up to increase here. Kindness. Okay. No. And I'm pretty sure the uh, Yongan movie theater here, uh, which apparently for some reason is not... Uh, uh, fast travelable yet, even though I read the Youngin Wanderer. Uh, well, I, I guess because it was unlocked during a, from a, from a, a request, it wouldn't be part of that. The Good Father, which is also uh, kindness. Okay, well, we want proficiency. I don't want to do the batting cages game because I'm not good at that. Or oh, I'm just assuming I'm not good at it. I haven't tried it yet. What the hell can we do? Uh, let's check out the diner, I guess. We have that new, um, that new thing here in the diner. Hmm. What the hell? Let's, uh, let's, let's check it out. Hmm. The new totem pole. Oh, good! It helps our proficiency. What? You want to eat? Holy crap! Look at that. You're going to eat this while studying? Just, just be sure not to topple it. Nice. 
Nice going. <laughs> I love them twirling the chopsticks like that. There's some proficiency right there. That's some proficiency you've got eating that without knocking mm. it over. And it's just a single point, but whatever. All right. Hey. <laughs> All right. Well, we got some useless knowledge points. All right. Want to head back? All right. And if we've got nobody to hang out with this evening, we are going to uh, watch that uh, DVD. Oh, in case you would like to stay appraised of the situation, little has changed with my father so far. Well, I appreciate the consideration. I've yet to truly speak with him, though. Uh, as I've said before, this is just what happened to Madarame. Uh, there's no need to worry. Still, I'm sorry. I know you're all waiting to hear about the mental shutdown, culprit. Father is physically weak, so it may take some time. No need to get hasty. Yeah, you know what? Look, be patient, but there's no need to be hasty here. He's right. He'll definitely have a change of heart. In that case, ain't it time to be t talking about our next uh, celebration party? Yeah, isn't that coming up soon? Too soon. Too stupid. <laughs> okay. That's funny. Actually, no, I don't think the celebration stuff seems to happen until after the, uh, the change of heart, so... <laughs> that was exactly what, uh, what I expected, actually. Yeah. Well, we can talk about that some other time. For now, let's wait patiently. Yes, I'll contact everyone if anything comes up. Well, Soji's not available. Anyway... Uh, Oya... I could hang out with Mishima, but uh, right now, to me, it's more important to uh, it's more important to finish the uh, or to finish ranking up uh, our proficiency. So uh, that's not going to be ready. That's too soon for the plant. Okamura Foods has been rocked by allegations of unethical work conditions. I think we've heard this before. A reporter succeeded... Oh, really? They succeeded in getting an interview with a man who used to work for the company. What he described was a harsh work environment where employees are not allowed any freedom. Whoa. Having a job sounds like you have a lot of hard work. What are you going to do when you're an adult? Good question. I'll let you know what I know. <laughs> Let's watch a DVD. Guy Mekver, or Mikver. leaking from the tank we need to do something fast it's fine i'll just use this chocolate see the acid and the sugar are reacting i heard half of that uh it's a story about a man who never gives up and he beats the odds with science and ingenuity wow he fixed the tank's crack with chocolate oh my god how does he stay so calm with such a pinch? You know what? That that really does sound like a MacGyver thing. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, hey. The protagonist maneuvered himself well despite the situation. But you've learned something about proficiency watching this drama. Hmm. Yeah, we got no, two more points of proficiency. And the next one should give right. us three. And from there, I guess we're, uh, yeah. we're just going to be making tools until uh, our proficiency maxes out. Because I don't have any more uh, DVDs uh, after this for that, and I certainly don't have any more books for proficiency. So, uh, unless we get a, a movie uh, rotates in, now that we're in a new month, actually, we might have new movies. Uh, what do you think will happen to Okamura Foods? Shucks. Oh, well, even if the CEO has a change of heart, the company's image is still in ruins. Yeah, that's actually very true. It'd be really hard to come back from that. I imagine their stocks plummeted. Do you think Okamura really exploited his employees? <laughs> Every little rumor goes viral these days. What if it was all just a lie? If so, the real victims here are the employees themselves. You know, there's actually some truth to that statement there. Like, if this was all just some blown up rumor sort of thing, then, then holy crap. But unfortunately, we do know otherwise. So, now, nah, the rumors about Okamura Foods were well known in the industry. You're overthinking it.
Are we wearing our blazer? Were we wearing our blazer in the current, the, the current, the current? Wow, in the late, earlier days. Or I guess now maybe we've switched over because we're in the fall. I, I don't know. No training. What you up to? It's hard to stay calm. Hard to stay calm. I'm gonna be acting about asking about mementos, right? It's hard to decide to stay calm, and all we can do is wait. Oh, I just remembered. We still have, a, yeah, requests and mementos. I'm going to the side later. All right. Uh, Makoto's is ready. Utaba is ready. Shinya. Um. Well, I'm going to go talk to uh, to Chihaya. And I don't know if this is actually going to be helpful right now, but I'm going to ask for some uh, affinity reason, reason, an affinity reading with uh, with Shoji, with Shoji, with Soji. Jesus, my God, my whew, speaking in me. What shall we do? Just hopefully to to keep him pop topped up a little bit, sort of thing, because I've been uh, I've been scraping the barrel with him, sort of thing. It seems so. Uh, Sojiro. I don't know if this is actually going to do anything because he's already ready to rank up. I'm assuming it's still going to give like maybe one or two points. I have no idea because it doesn't say. But let's let let's pay attention here. What does she say at the end here? Your feelings should have reached the other person. I bet you can deepen your friendship even further now. Okay. Now I believe he was already ready to rank up, but the fact that it's saying it's saying this there, uh, that actually might mean that they are now ready to to rank up. I what do you think? should. I really want to take a look at what it said when I did um, uh, Hifumi there, and I actually hope Hifumi is available tonight just so I can see if she's ready to rank up or not, because that actually might be the tell of whether or not uh, it is. So we're going to go check the um, the secondhand shop again, and uh, well, I'm going to check the theater here as well just to see if the movie changed. And ooh, new month, so I wonder if they restock these things once a month or if it's once every couple of weeks I have no idea Should keep try to remember to keep an eye on that okay we're not just in time to see back to the ninja it's about a guy who goes back in time to learn ninjutsu and avenge his friends who were slain by ninja that's kind of funny uh, it increases knowledge really it increases knowledge that kind of sounds like it'd be increasing proficiency but oh well uh, so, start of the month means new movies, so I kind of wish I checked the theater in, uh, in Shinjuku while I was there just to see. But, oh well, not a big deal at the moment. Hey, Futaba! All right. I am indeed free today. We still have Vicorn. Let's rank Futaba up. Alright, the only... The one thing left in the promise list being okay without you around. But... Before that, there's something I want to show you, Darren. Um. Come to my room. Um. Uh, this is one of my promise lists I made with my mom. See, everything on here is marked off as being done. But that's kind of wrong. There was one promise I lied about doing. One promise I never actually finished. It was, get along with Kanachan. This all started back when I was in elementary school. I used to get bullied pretty hard from for how weird it was. Yeah, I understand that one, kiddo. The other kids always accused me of cheating because I'd get perfect scores on my tests. The one time I turned the test in with nothing written on it. Oof. Uh, but the school ended up yelling at my mom. Of course. My life at school was horrible. Uh, sometimes during recess, I'd lock myself in the bathroom and cry. Oh, that's terrible. I didn't have a single friend. Uh, I was always alone. But then a girl named Kana transferred to my school. She was, abs she was absent a lot at first. Then when she was there, the other kids bullied her like they did to me. But one day, she said something... Yeah, she said something to me. Good morning. She started saying it every day from then on. Must have been a shock. How did you react? Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna go with this. Were you happy? Yes. 
There we go. She's not ready to rank up. Hmm. Maybe I should have uh, asked for Futaba's stuff to go up. Yeah, but I was mostly surprised. Literally nobody wanted to talk to me back then. To be honest, I completely ignored her at first few times. I thought bullies had put her up to it. Uh, but without fail, she'd come over to me and say good morning. Then eventually I decided to say it back. It felt like my heart was going to shatter in a million pieces. <laughs> but apparently she'd been saying it to me the whole time because she thought we could be friends. She was the first person who didn't mind how weird I was. I was so happy about making a friend that I told my mom. And when she was at its... That's when she added something to my promise list. Get along with Kanachan. But uh, I couldn't do it. One particularly windy morning, Kanachan dropped her diary and uh, the pages flew everywhere. I didn't really mean to look, but I ended up seeing everything she had written down. And once I see something, I can't forget it. Yeah, she actually did mention previously that she had uh, a memory like that. It was also horrible. She wrote about how her parents hit her. How they made her take pictures in weird clothes. Oh, Jesus. Kana-chan's diary was full of stories like that. And then when I asked her about it, she got really defensive. I felt terrible, but she just kept yelling at me for reading it. Uh, well, you didn't know any better. <laughs> okay, that was an okay thing to say. Yeah, but I couldn't really tell her that. I just froze up. And then I ran. I ran and ran. I wanted to stop yelling. I wanted her to stop yelling. I wanted to go back to how things were before. Kanachan ended up moving away pretty soon after that. I haven't talked to her since. So I lied to my mom. Even after Kanachan left, I would tell her we were best friends. Every month, she'd write that promise on my list. Every month, I'd lie about it. I. <sighs> I wish I could apologize to Kanachan somehow. I really want to say I'm sorry. Sorry for not helping her. Though she was going through even worse stuff than I was. Sorry for reading her diary. Sorry for running away. I hate being such a coward. This is a pretty crappy situation to, to actually find yourself in. and I, I can definitely understand how she's feeling there. I think I might be able to face my fears now that I'm pro uh, that I'm a promise settling phantom thief. <laughs> Get along with Kanachan. I'm gonna do it for real this time. Well, good for you. Seriously, that uh, I didn't mean to tell you all that. Yeah, you did. You did. <laughs> Not even Sochiro knows. This is so embarrassing. Well, something like that is is definitely easier to talk to a friend than a parent. At least, that, that, that's how I would feel about something like that. You, uh... You have to help me now, got it? <laughs> Someone's pushy today. <laughs> no, I understand. There's another part of our deal. Alright, feels like she's starting to depend on me. Because she wasn't already at this point. Active support, yeah. Charge or recover SP. Alright. Well, I'm gonna get on that right now. Time to go look at Kanachan's de- I don't know what that said, but... <laughs> something about Kanachan, huh? Oh, and sorry, I wasn't too hospitable today. I'll have to wait till next time. Get out of my room, goodbye! <laughs> now make like a cheetah and dash out of my room! <laughs> yeah, I was expecting something along those lines. Hey, Akechi is here. Who's talking to me? Do you have time today? And she is in fact ready to rank up now, so I believe that uh, message about your friends going deeper sort of thing there is actually telling you that it is... Uh, that it's ready to rank up. That's good. So what the hell are we gonna... Oh, we're gonna finish watching that uh, DVD uh, is what we're going to do tonight. So what does Akechi have to say? Good evening. Oh, good evening. I'm intruding in your home again, once again. 
<laughs> oh, my apologies for sending so much time here. It's just uh, such a coming place for me. This is what you said last time, isn't it? <laughs> this is exactly what he said last time. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'm not going to be a dick. I have no reason to be a dick now. Thank you. Regardless, it's time I go on my way. Oh, one more thing, though. I heard a calling card has finally been sent. The rumors of the inter of internal affairs at Okumura Foods are true. Their president should surely be judged. However, it should be the government or police to do so. This is an unfortunate situation. I must be going now. Coffee was delicious. Bye, Akechi. How much laundry do I have? Uh, no, nah, not worth it now. I only have two things here. Uh, however, do we have ingredients for curry? Looks like we're out of curry ingredients. Let's try to make some another day. Looks like the chief made curry. I doubt there are any leftovers. Okay. Well, I guess we will uh, ask Kawakami to make some coffee. Yep. Make sure you close up. Don't waste the beans. Got it. I'm gonna head out. Hi. Uh, she's still gonna come over and make us some coffee. There we go. All right. So now that she's making us some coffee, what does our uh, table have to tell us for today? Oh, Discovery, Town Detectives. These irregular broadcast specials were sharing limited edition items that are all the rage. Today we're going to be talking about the relaxing and therapeutic scent of Refresh Aroma. With a special mix of autumn ingredients, this item has been flying off the shelves. It's from the Body Chop. From the Body Chop. Great name for a shop there. Uh, I hope the only underground mall... Oh. I hope the only, the one, oh my god, I can read. Yeah, hopefully the one in the Shibuya mall has some still. Wow, reading. Why is so difficult? <laughs> oh. So what do you want to do? We're going to finish the uh, Guy Mikver DVD. Damn, they shut off the power. How are we going to rig an alarm now? Whoever said you need electricity to make an alarm? Give me that empty soda can. I'll just tie it to this string. The only thing I heard in there was, give me the sugar can, and I'll tie it to the string. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> oh, man. Nice. The main character is able to make all sorts of things, just with what he has at hand. Oh. All right, we finished watching the DVD. Look at our proficiency. Still only two more points. I was expecting three for finishing that, damn it. Alright. Okay. Well yeah. let's go to sleep. Hey, hopefully we'll get lucky and our the drink we can take today uh, this Sunday will be uh will be a proficiency drink. Hi. That'd be nice. We got our LeBlanc coffee. So, is that the same coffee we had previously, or was that the better version? I think maybe we have to be the one to brew it to get the better version. Who knows? Who could it be at this hour? The movie theater nearby is showing a great classic sci-fi movie. You have tomorrow off, right? Have any plans? Let's go see Back to the Ninja. Well, it's knowledge, so no thank you. Um, I'm just going to tell her outright no thank you. Because I'm not going to use that for knowledge. If it was proficiency, I would definitely jump on that. Because I'm pretty sure it would be points towards Futaba as well as the uh, the, the, the stat boost. So we're going to come on. Oh, that's too bad. Uh, time to make like a tree. While you're trying to get down, it is your choice. Let's go to bed. Oh, what's this? Can't wait for his public apology. They should just execute everyone who causes trouble for society. Holy crap! Well, <laughs> that is one attitude to have, but wow! Little extreme. 
Well, maybe they could take my boss down. <laughs> Politicians who knock the Phantom Thieves are just sore losers. That or they have something to hide. What about that Ketchikun? Is he too afraid of backlash or comment? Probably. He's actually said that in the past, that he's learned from his past mistakes. He's not going to say anything on the matter. Alright, we are definitely... Nice. Yeah, not good for that. What do we have today for our table? Some shopping time. What do we have? Donut worry. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh, 20 of them for probably 1980. Yep. Uh, I'm going to assume this probably either cures hunger or forget. So, uh, what the hell? Let's just... Let's go for it. If anything, it's just to see what they do. It's another buyer. Alright. Alright. Oh, you know what, actually? Oh, shady commodity stuff came in. Let's, uh... What do we have here? Uh, I'll buy a fragmented armor. Uh... Oh, that's right, I didn't bother buying it because 20% chance to reflect physical is worthless to me. Spyware laden gear. Um... This can still be useful, so I'm gonna buy that. And that will be it. Oh, shelf. Let's see. Why don't we decorate the room a bit? Um, hero figure. What the hell? Is there... I... <laughs> I couldn't tell what that actually looked like. It, it kind of looked like... It actually looks like a doll with a dar with a Dolph... Oh my god, speaking. A Darth Vader mask. So I'm gonna try and blow that up on, in editing just to get a closer look at that because that, that <laughs> looks kind of funny. Alright, uh, first of all, Yusuke. Makoto. Uh, I don't believe Futaba was ready to rank up at the end of that. It didn't look like it. So first of all, we're going to go to the red light district. I'm going to get an affinity reading for uh, Futaba. Oh. What shall we do? Affinity reading. Come on, Futaba. There we go. Okay. Bet you can deepen your friendship further now. Okay, well, it sounds like what do you think? if I was just misremembering and she wasn't ready to rank up, or she was ready to rank up, she still is, but if she wasn't, it sounds like she is now. What do we have playing here? The Avengers? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, holy crap. Uh, again, kindness. Why? All of these movies up kindness. Alright, uh, Shinjuku, we are going to head back to... What's this? Omokoto. Oh, We're going to head back quickly to the theater here. Because I want to see, um... I want to see what's playing here. Admission impossible. <laughs> Proficiency. Oh, you know what? I... I may actually, uh watch that movie. However, I'm going to return a DVD. We are going to take a drink in the Underground Mall. Um, where am I going? This is where I'm going. Okay, let's return the DVD. No late fees. Return. What, do we else, what else do we have here? Nothing, so... Alright, let's... Uh, Let's go to the underground walk, underground mall. We're going to drink that drink. Actually, we're going to. I wanted the underground walkway. <laughs> Damn it! Where the heck am I? What? Ser seriously, where am I? I was not expecting to be here. I was. I was expecting to be over here, like every other time. 
Oh, hi Yusuke. Alright. Uh, increases knowledge. Dang. Alright, well, we are going to go back over to the theater here. And we are going to watch this movie next time. Because we're at a half an hour now. So thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And hopefully you'll come by to see what kind of corny dialogue we're going to have for uh, admission impossible. So until then, take care, you hear?